me the name of your film and tell me about it. I am here with a short documentary called Our Neighbors the Peacocks, which is sort of what it sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's about a suburban neighborhood near Los Angeles where residents attempt to cohabitate with hundreds of wild peacocks uh, that live on their lawns and in their trees and on their roofs. Oh my goodness, what neighborhood is this in? It's called Arcadia, it's a city. Oh, Arcadia? Yeah. yeah. Oh my goodness, so there's wild peacocks just running around? Hundreds of them. Oh my goodness, how did you find this story? Um, well, actually my husband brought me there on a date. <laughs> he thought it would be romantic. Uh, my family is from India and so are the peacocks. And I think he thought it would be romantic to bring me there. And then I just really fell in love with the neighborhood and the people. And I went during mating season, which is the loudest time of the year. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was kind of this crazy opera unfolding in front of me. And I just kept going back and met the neighbors and thought I really needed to make a short about this. And the neighbors are happy with the peacocks. They don't try to... Well, there's drama. Uh, there yeah. is... Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, the plot thickens. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's I, drama. Uh, Arcadia is is the only neighborhood that has wild peacocks, peafowl is the technical term, uh, who have voted to not relocate them and to live amongst them. But there's a, a number of other neighborhoods around L.A. that relocate them and get rid of them. But there's always neighbors who are pretty unhappy every mating season, so, yeah. And what would you like audiences to take away from this? Uh, I think I found, I was really surprised to learn uh, that the neighbors were so willing to coexist with nature in this way, even though it's quite uncomfortable and a nuisance for them and loud and annoying. And uh, I think I was just really charmed by how accepting they were of of the peacocks who lived there before the houses were built and wanting to find a way to live amongst them and it was you know just very charming and nice to see people um, existing with nature in that way even at their own expense. And how does it feel to have this film here at the Santa Barbara International Film Festival? It feels very nice. It's such a beautiful incredible festival. Yeah I feel very lucky to be here. Well, we're so glad to have you. It sounds like a fabulous story. I can't wait to see it. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thanks.